By the way, did you know that a labor ban can be imposed on a person or an employee leaving his job without finishing his contract in the UAE? It is true. In this video, we want us to look at the four instances where an employee can resign without giving a notice to his employer. Remember, when we are talking about the new labor laws in the UAE, we can't fail to talk about resignation, we can't fail to talk about the notice period, then we can't fail to talk about the contract, the mutual relationship between the employee and the employer. Because it's, that relationship is what is going to govern the contract at the end of it all. If the employer breaches the contract, the employee will have the right to go, according to the Minister of Emiratization and Human Resources. Again, if an employee breaches the contract with the employer, the employer has a right over the employee, either imposing what we call a travel ban or imposing a penalty, pay up a penalty because of the breaching of the contract. Meaning that in all situations, meaning that in all situations, we can see what we call a 50-50 win on both sides of the employer and the employee. In case both of them or one of them gets to violate or breach what we will sign in the contract, or is again is called the contrary of what was signed in the contract, which is right. But again, what are those some of the instances? that an employee can resign without notifying his employer. But remember still, your employer also can terminate you without a notice. In case you do not follow this one. For example, let's give an example. This employer does not know your way about for almost 7 or 14 days. For almost 7 days. He doesn't know where you went. He does not have any communication. Let's say for example this was your duty area. You left your location. You left your duty area. You left your job. You left your responsibility. You went out without even informing him. He does not know. You. He does not know where you are. He does not reach, he cannot reach you. He'll probably launch what you call a complaint to the Ministry of Emeritization and Humanization. With proof, you did not communicate. That means that employer has a right to terminate you without a notice. And termination may not be enough. You may even be given what you call a ban. So, which is quite very serious in that situation. But again, let us try to look at a situation where the employee himself or where by the employee can move on without even giving a notice to his employer on this other side. One, for example, if the employee is absent for seven consecutive days without what we call a lawful reason your employer will terminate you without giving you a notice all right let us go to into some of these four reasons that your employer or reasons that the employee may try to terminate himself without even giving the employer a notice period as according to the UAE labor law. One, if the employer has failed to meet the contractual agreement or what you call the legal obligation that was signed in the contract. For example, if the legal obligation that was signed in the contract between you and the employer, it was the employer has to pay you your wages on time. He has to give you good accommodation. He has to give you good transport in the contract. And he does not do that. Contrary what you need to do at that time, you'll have to notify a complaint to the ministry. 
And once complete, once you launch that complaint to the ministry, if it is not worked on within seven days, if the employer does not comply within the seven days, then you have the right to go without giving your employer notice. That is according to the labor law. Still, if we look at a situation whereby the employee is being has is being is being harassed, you know. He may be harassed by the employer himself or he may be harassed by the immediate supervisor or he may be harassed by the coordinator or being harassed by any of the superior in that kind of life. And it is proved to be beyond the reasonable doubt that this person was being harassed by his superior. Let's say the line supervisor. Let's say the team supervisor. Let's say the manager himself. Then, as according to the UAE labor law, this employee has a right to move or to terminate himself from the contract, from the, uh, the, the contract without even giving a notice period because he's being harassed and it's not allowed by the UAE labor law. Hope I'm right and hope I'm saying the right. Then, we look at uh, situation number three, whereby the employee is living under what you call safety threats. The employee's safety life is not up to the standard that was agreed upon. Let's say the working conditions at the workplace, they are not good. And the employer himself is not willing to comply or to improve the working conditions. It is a threat to the safety or to the life of the employee at that time. And this time, the employer is not responding positively. Then this employee has to make a complaint or to lodge a complaint to the Ministry of Emeritization and Human Resource in the UAE. Once that complaint is reached and still the employer does not comply, then that means you can move on without giving what you call a notice period to what you call your employer. Hope I'm speaking out, hope I'm telling you you're picking out the right. Then still, an employer can resign or can move away from this job minus giving a notice period to his employee or to this employer in case, in case, the employer gives you a job or he gives you a job or roles that you do not sign for. You under the labor law or the UAE labor law, you have that right to refuse. If, for example, in your company or from your home country, you are hired as a security guard. But now, when you reach your company, you are acting as a cook and you feel you're not comfortable with what is given to you as per what was the agreement of the requirement of your job offer or your contract, then by the UAE law, you have the right to move on. You have the right to go without giving what you call a notice. Hope I'll try to share up something for you. Thank you so much for coming back to this channel. By the way, remember it's Mix from the Mix Creation. If it's your first time to come across this channel, give up the thumbs up grab. By the way, don't forget to hit the notification bell because it's very important when uploading new videos. See you again in the next video.